那开始吧。好 ，Hello everyone, can you hear me? Um, welcome to Biomic Stay and Web Editor Biomic Stay and Webinar. My name is Lei. Uh, I'm your host today. Today we invite to Mr. Kang to talk about Biomic approach of liquefy color ceramic paste for dental technicians daily work. The course will last uh, one hour and a half. Uh, after meeting, Mr. Kang will have 30 minutes to question and answer. So you can leave your message on your comment area. Uh, and the course is free. You can call your friends to join us together. Enjoy it. Now let's move on to Mr. Kang. Mr. Kang, can you hear me? You yes, can start. Okay. Thank you, Lei. And thanks to everyone uh, 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 spend your time to join the, this webinar. And I also thanks the edit invited me to uh, present about the new biomix thing and how to use. And uh, this is my concept to help them develop this new material. And if possible, I want to share my experience and uh, let everyone know uh, this material, which one is different others, and uh, how to use and how to help you to save your time in your daily work. And then now uh, we don't to uh, spend all the time, so now I'm ready to start. Okay, and uh, to, this is my today's topic. Is a biomic approach of the liquefied, uh, sorry, is a uh, approach of liquefied color ceramic paste for dental technicians that work. And I want to share and uh, how to uh, make our work is more like uh, real and uh, more fast. And this is uh, added to the new product and uh, we make it on market last year, July. And if possible, and I also uh, believe now is the many technician is still use this one. But in this uh, very difficult situation about the COVID nineteen in the world, so I think that about the technique uh, communication is very difficult and not easy to travel different country. So now we just can to use a webinar to present and uh, help you to know how to use it. And then maybe uh, after the discourse and uh, do you, uh, if you have any question, please uh, let me know. I will try to answer you and, uh, and do my best. Thank you. And uh, I wanted to very first introduce about uh, Biomic, the stain system. And this is the all-in-one that we can to use it on many different material and uh, just use one concept. And uh, this material is a precise color and uh, stable uh, material property. And uh, it's very easy to control and uh, use. And uh, we also create it is a liquefied ceramic. It's a color liquefied ceramic. And I also can use a very easy skill make you to feel and uh, uh, we say is a simulation like the porcelain layer. It's like uh, after the, uh, after you use the biomic, you can get it like a porcelain layer uh, uh, restoration. And if for multi case, multi unit case, we can very fast finish our work and save many time and help you to improve about your uh, life quality. We don't spend a lot of time in our lab all day. And it's also uh, have the best wear resistant. So it's not easy to wear in the, in the patient's mouth and this color and the material can keep a very, very long time. And I say it's the all-in-one so we can use it on the metal ceramic for external stand, just only external stand because the if you back it to high temperature, sometimes the biomica will become more gray because it's the low fusing uh, pulsating passive stand. So we can to make it to back high temperature. But for low, low temperature, we can use it 
uh, on the metal ceramic surface to external state and that you can get a very nice and a good effect. And that we also can to use it on the listen DCK ceramic surface to modify. And also uh, the Konya ceramic or monolithic listen DCK and monolithic the Konya. And uh, I said we can to use the uh, metal ceramic, so I can tell you it can to external stand on a different metal base. Maybe it's the cobalt chrome or the gold alloy or the silver alloy. But sometimes the silver alloy will make the our the uh, biomic is uh, uh, become a little gray. So please, if you want to use it on. Um, uh, silver alloy ceramic is tunnel stand. Please make sure your furnace is uh, clear. So you can to clear your furnace first because the silver sometimes will some uh, metal outside and uh, some 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 um, after the degrees it will it will something will burn out on the, your furnace and the later will make the the porcelain become a little gray, green and gray, and the biomic is also the same. But for the cobalt chrome or gold alloy, it's no problem. So we can easy to get the nice the effect. So we just the two layer denting and the enamel, but we can use the biomic external stain on the outside and you can create a hollow effect, quick line, marmalade, or the white spa, white band. So it's very easy. And the just the one bag. Sorry. Uh, is there something wrong? Uh, sorry, wait me a minute. Uh, yeah, it's okay. And and uh, when I to help learn to develop this the new system, and uh, I have the concept about the daily work for the external stain and the overlaying uh, skill. So this is my concept about the color structure. So I say this is the color structure. We can do analyze and the spray and the color is the main color and the cervical high situation area and the marmalade is the warm area and the uh, uh, translucent area is the cold area. So my design color is to match the, this concept. So we can very easy to find our one color can to uh, apply on this area. Uh, with me a limit, I, I will to uh, adjust my computer. It's a, it's a little lag. Wait a minute, two minutes. I will to try to uh, release my memory. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I think now we are more smooth. Okay. We try again. Yes. And I want to tell you an uh, interesting thing. Sorry about the internet, the webinar sometimes we have a trouble and uh, it's a uh, very uh, interesting and we don't know what's happened, but I will try to make everything more smooth. So if you have uh, something problem, please forgive me. <laughs> and I, I wanted to explain about the, my, my comments from where. I wanted to uh, tell you in the CIE color system, our T color area is very small, just the more close the red and the yellow. And uh, this is a very interesting study from the big, uh, big master Yamamoto Makoto. He's the Japanese the dental master. And uh, he helped the Shofu to create the NCC color system. 
And the last study told us tooth color is almost just only the A shade and the small B shade. It's no C and the D because the C and the D is also the A shade, just more dark and more uh, gray. And another the, the study from the, the top dentist, the top B, and he told us the 80% case is, uh, is the A shade. So this is an interesting thing. So in my concept, if you want to uh, create your crown or your, your restoration to match the Vida shade, it's like the C and D, you can use the uh, base shirt as C and the best shirt D. But uh, for to copy the neutral case, in my, in my opinion, I usually use the C and D to be the cervical area color because it's a more strong and high situation. So this is the interesting thing. So if you uh, follow this concept to find the main color area, high stream area and the warm area and the cold area. You just uh, to choose the biomic color to match this area and that you can very easy to create like a neutral uh, look case. And that you are easy to make the your restoration, monolithic restoration like a real case and like a real tooth. You can to see this case. I just follow this concept and this skill. So I can very easy to uh, get, I want the effect from uh, this case. And uh, I say that this case is open system is a no limit effect because we have a very big mixed range. We can to use a make anything. And then later I will explain to you. I say that we have the 60 color and the three glass paste. One is the glass paste is the fluorescent and the two is the 3D layer. It's more like the pulsating powder, but it's the paste. Okay. And now you can to see, we have the yellow and the pink color. And then we can to use the to mix and the to make the, our main color more color like the neutral case is not only shared A, B, C, D. Because the, if we want to duplicate the real case, we need to find the real color. So you can to use this skill to match like the elect, but you can to find the A and the B red to miss it. And then we create the orange two is a middle area and you can use it to miss other. And uh, we have a terracotta is a high stream area color, and uh, you can use it to mix the brown and the shade C and the shade D. And the orange is for the hollow effect. And uh, we have the 3D and is the positive layer on the surface. So you can use it to mix any color to create a you want the custom positive layer. And uh, we also have the full translucent color. You can use it to mix, and there's no meaning and that you can create, you want the light, dark, or a translucent effect. And that we also have a two different liquid and that you can very easy use it to create and uh, to control your past have a different consistency. Liquid one is, uh, uh, you can use it to diluting and it's a more easy, uh, it's a more uh, flow and uh, you, if you use it to uh, miss the, your past and uh, you can make it a very thin, and uh, you also can use the liquid to, to miss your past and uh, you can to uh, make it like a porcelain layer and uh, make it have the thickness and uh, you can use the uh, laying skill to apply your monolithic surface. And uh, this is a short video you can to see how to do. And I show you to use the two different liquid to mix the, this is a powder, this is a stem powder. And we can still see this is a liquid one. And we uh, use the liquid one to mix the powder and you can eat more, uh, become more like the stem. Uh, it's just only the stem. But we use the, the liquid two to mix the powder. You can see it become like the paste. So 
Liquid two is a, a, a is a ceramic solution, so is a it can help you to uh, miss anything become the paste, even the porcelain powder, and you can make everything like the paste, and you can more easy to layer on your monolithic restoration surface. And we also to uh, have the main color area, we can choose the shade A, shade B, shade C, shade D, and use the yellow and the pink are to mix. So it's a very easy concept and easy to know and easy to learn. You see, this is a shade A, and I can to use a shade A to mix the uh, shade C or shade D. Or I can do to mix the orange to brown and terracotta and the different color. And uh, you can easy to control your red color. And uh, you can do see even is the different path to mix. But uh, we can do get a very smooth and the balance the miss, miss the uh, result. It's not the see the particle or rough surface. You can do see it's a very smooth and the softer color. Even with we to mix it. And this is the translucent area. We also have a blue one, blue two, and the black and the purple. And the black and the purple to me, so we can do control different situation to create the, like the translucent or, the, or the, uh, we say the illusion area. We can do create the illusion effect on your, uh, your age part, even in the moralistic restoration. You use this skill purple to miss the break. You can very easy to create the illusion. And we also can to miss the blue one, blue two, or to miss the three D or a glass for for a to, to get the different situation. You can to see it. This is the glass F, and we to miss the purple and the purple to miss the break. We can do see different situation and the different illusion effect. And this blue one, blue two, we also can do miss the glass. You can do see this is a reduced effect. And the blue one, and the blue two to miss, or blue one or blue two to miss the black or to miss the purple. So we can very easily use the full color with the uh, glass paste. We can do miss a lot of different effect for your restoration work. But I say that if you just wanted to duplicate like the uh, 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 Vida shape, 3D shape, the, the, the tools, you just uh, follow very standard procedure. You can very easy and fast get you want. But you want to duplicate the neutral case or neutral tools, you just you can do use the different paths to miss and uh, create and get you want the custom color. And then we also have the different effects, the, like the orange one is a mamelon and the hollow effect, or a cervical area, or a blue one, or the white, or the white sea. And I say this is an open system. If you want, you also can to use it to mix the other system, uh, stem powder. Maybe I like to use the, uh, my biomaker. Sometimes I, I will use it to mix the sun. Uh, initial space system, or you want, you can do miss the IPS Everclass, uh, uh, Everclass uh, uh, essential system, or a hurry around the stain universal is also okay. But if you want, you use the biomic pads to miss the powder, other brand powder stain, you must use the liquid to make the powder become the paste, and uh, you just can to miss them, and the later will make a layer to miss more well and the balance. But if the two miss or, or already is the paste system, it's no problem, you can direct miss it. So we can to use the original biomaker to create everything you want. If you don't want to spend your time to uh, miss the, the, the biomaker to create, uh, to create you want cosmic color, you can do the right to choice other system they have the color is you can to the red use and just miss the liquid two or to miss a little maybe 3D paste or the glass paste or you can do edit to the biomic to 
uh, inquisitor about the situation. And then this is a short video to show you how to miss them. It's very easy. This is the original uh, the terracotta paste. It's a very nice and a good the material property. Even if it look a little dry, but you just the, to use the spatula and the condense it, and it's a, uh, become very uh, uh, easy to control. And then this is the other brand, uh, the, 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 the paste stand. You can to see, we can to make it uh, more weight and uh, you can already miss it. And this is the powder stand. If you want to use the powder stand to mix with uh, your uh, biomic paste and uh, you must use the liquid too to mix uh, this powder stand. You can to see, we can very easy make this uh, powder stand become the paste. So even you have the other stain system and you want to make it like the paste and then or make them become the paste stain, even it's the evaporizing powder or, uh, or uh, maybe the, the second, uh, do you say wrong, second stain system. You can use the liquid to, to mix them. You can make everything become the paste. And then now you can very easy to mix them very well and the balance. You see, this is the past to miss the past. And then now we can do miss the biomic with the powder paste. And then they also can do miss very well. Don't direct you the powder to miss the biomic because sometimes you can to see the particle size and there is not a very balanced and uh, to miss very well. So it's, uh, it's uh, very easy. So I say this is open, not only the biomic. You can do use it to, uh, with any brand or any system. You can miss that, don't worry. But don't to miss the to, uh, high temperature stain system over the 800. Because sometimes if you to miss it, and uh, use the biomic, the uh, back temperature. Sometimes you can do see the surface is a little rough and not shiny. So you need to glaze again. If you want to miss the high temperature powder stain, you must uh, to uh, miss the, some maybe the glass paste. And uh, we don't to create a very interesting three color. This is three color is a red, brown, olive green, and the deep orange. But the, why I don't to design these three color? Because these three color is almost uh, to very strong and the opacity and the dirty colorization. Like the maybe the, uh, quick light, sicker stain or a groove stain and the uh, olive green maybe is a coccolite stain or a plasma stain. And the two orange sometimes you can to see in the plasma or a denting well area or plasma stain or the root stain or groove stain. You can do see it on, maybe this is the quick lie, and uh, we can do see cervical have the calcareous stain, and uh, this is also a uh, cervical have a calcareous stain. And uh, this part more have the deep orange, and the root area have the deep orange. You see, it's a deep orange and a little brown. It's a dirty, and the uh, posterior, we can do see the groove have the uh, 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 deep orange, and uh, this you can do see the reddish brown. Why I don't to design this three color? Because this is three color, almost the dentist or the patient, they don't like it. This is an old, old man teeth, is old age teeth. Sometimes we create the restoration, we don't need to duplicate it. So we don't use it the usually and the not uh, every time. But the interesting two reasons I don't to uh, create is the three color because I believe every lab have a similar color. So you just use the liquid to, to mix the other brand and then you can guess that this is three color. And I think I use it the old light. I say it's not usually to use. So you can do see even for the maybe juicy pattern system. The red brown is a SPS 10 and the olive green is SPS 8. The orange is SPS 40. 
And then maybe the events is essential, is a red brown, is a, a the E11, and the olive gray is a E15. And the deep orange is E10. Or a hurry surround system is the marrow and the olive and the mango. So I say that you can do get the, this the three color in other system and that this is not usually used because this is three color is a dirty opacity and then not the normal to uh, use on your daily work restoration. So I think that you don't to buy that and the editor also don't want to sell you this. So you just the choice the other brand. So it's a very easy, just use the liquid too and the to mix and then make the lamp become the pest and that you can very too easy use it with the bio mix. So don't worry that. And we also have the 3D layer and this is, the, is a, like the porcelain layer and that we can uh, apply it very easy, get the porcelain look after back. Surface light refreshing and the effect is like the porcelain layer. So we have the 3 dn is the translucent and the 3 dv is more high brightness and that you can apply on the surface to create and uh, or increase your value. But if you want to get the other color, you also can do use the 3 dn to miss the other uh, biomix stain color. Maybe like we can do mix the to blue, orange, pink. And then you can still see this is the after miss the effect and you can direct apply on your more stick. This is the person there, color person there. And uh, you can do after back and uh, you can do see the effect. And the 3D there and the 3D effect paste is more uh, sticky and uh, it's uh, almost use the liquid to, to miss. So if you want to uh, create and control it more easy to layer, Please use the liquid to, to miss it. But you, you also can to use the liquid one to miss the 3D test. And you can make it very, very thin and more like a stand test and easy to apply on your surface. But if you want to create or adjust your contour, your crown legs, or your contact area, contact points, you also can to use the 3D apply on your monolithic the surface. And the just the right to use it. And I say that you also can to create that you want is the cast main, the, the porcelain layer is a cast main 3D layer. You just use the liquid to, to miss the low fusing, the porcelain powder is like the stem powder, the skill and the concept. So I sometimes I, I like to, uh, to miss the, the initial lissy. Or you also can to use the creation LS or EMS or a hurry surround 750. Is a low fusing temperature porcelain. And then you can use a liquid to, to miss it and then create the Cosme the 3D test. And then this is a 3DV, is the test, porcelain test. And then you can do see, I can to miss the EOP2, is the high OPO. It's a high opal effect porcelain powder. And I use the liquid too. You can do see, I can do miss it. And uh, this is a trans translucent blue. So this is a two color I will show you, use the liquid to, to miss. Later we will make the powder is very sticky and strong and, uh, and the push to remove the bubble inside. So you can do see this a very mean, very mean is more bigger, but after the miss is uh, become the very small and the high density. So you can to see powder is very easy become the past. So when you use this skill, you can endure the lab to miss the low fusion temperature, maybe the EMAX, and then you can apply on the biomic or more restoration. And the biomic color is more smooth and you also can to use it to miss the porcelain powder. And I say that you, when you to apply, and you want to make the pencil is more uh, easy uh, control or make it more thin, you can to uh, miss a little, maybe the liquid one. So you see the powder is become the pest. So we can to create many different effect. So I say that we don't to create a lot of different uh, the porcelain layer 
you see maybe the some some different brand they have the 10 or 20 like the porcelain powder they create a lot of the porcelain layer on the monolithic, uh, monolithic system but the biomic just give you the two it's a very easy it's a one translucent and one high brightness but you can use the translucent to miss anything or use a liquid to to create anything you want and the letter will make everything is easy and i say you can to adjust your contour or your point lens and uh, you also can to uh uh apply on the contact area or the, the proximal point. It's the very easy and the fast because the low fusion temperature, you just have to back the 720 or 730 and it's a very fast program finish. And you don't worry about the, the, the bubble. And if you also want this, the, uh, this the 3D past to apply your positive crown, you want it to, uh, uh maybe the the added the sum the contact area or the or increase the sum the, the contact point or to adjust the, your positive crown the surface contour you can do also use the 3d layer it's a translucent and fast And I say we have the 3D value is the brightness and you apply on the Euromorphic surface and you can make your crown increase the high value. So it's a very too easy. And you can do apply more thick, you can do get the more high value, but it still have the translucent, not the opacity. So 3D is the 3D uh, value is the high brightness and the high opal and the high value and the don't to lose the bottle translucent. So this is the interest in the past. And is uh, uh, how to use it and the control, I will show you is uh, a little sticky and uh, like the weight of the porcelain powder. But it's uh, still the past. So you can do uh, apply it on the surface very, very thin. If you want to adjust the contour, you can do apply the more thick on maybe the marginal ridge or a cervical area. You can also to adjust or change your contour. But you can to apply on surface is the uh, very, very uh, thin thickness and the balance it. You see, it's very easy. It's like to layer the positive. And uh, when you after the 2D passes, then you can get a very nice uh, effect. But you want to make it more like the uh, laying crown, you must use the 3D pad. Why? Because the Reconia surface is a uh, uh, more strong light refraction. We want to uh, make it more soft so we can to apply the 3D is a porcelain layer on your uh, Reconia surface and then they will make it more soft. And that create more the uh, nice built the uh, light the uh, maybe the the the, the translucent or the, the refreshing or the dismission and the, that it will make the surface more uh, soft. And you can do see is a very light the uh, porcelain crown surface. Even even you can do see very very thin and uh, significant uh, micro texture. We can create it on the 3D layer surface. And we also have the very good material property. It's not easy to miss the bubble. You even is a little dry and you miss a lot of game, a lot of times. This is a very nice. You see? I can do mix is a very uh, fast and a lot. But you see, it's a no bubble. And this is the other brand. You can do see, it's not easy to miss in the strip. And after the miss, you can do see a lot of bubble inside. And when you, the material have a lot of bubble inside every bag, you also can do see a lot of bubble on surface. 
you tend to see many bubbles. And it's not easy to miss well and the balance. You see a lot of bubble inside. So it's a compare you can to see. It's a bubble. When you bubble is the is already in your material. After back, you will get the more bubble. But the biomic is very well and the smooth. And the, we don't worry about it after the, the mist. It's a very nice and the sticky and the high dentist. So we don't worry about the bubble after the back, especially with the vacuum. And the layer glass pads also have a high corrosion effect. So it's easy and very thin. You just um, uh, apply it on your reconia surface, you can get the high corrosion. So it's a, for the moralistic case, it's very easy to use. If you don't want to apply or change the color, you just uh, uh, make the, the your glass pads on the surface. After back, you can to see the high fluorescent effect. And the, this is the oh sorry. This is the back backing program. And uh, I think this is nothing you can to uh, uh, change the uh, it to uh, to match your furnace because every furnace is a little different. But uh, this is the official uh, recommendation. And the first bag is seven hundred thirty, and the second bag is uh, seven hundred twenty. But you also can to uh, adjust it to match your furnace. Maybe your furnace to bag seven hundred thirty is not shiny. You can to adjust and increase some temperature. And if the, your, temp, uh, your furnace is 730 is too high temperature, you can do adjust over to back to the 7, uh, 720. So it's just the official recommendation, but you can to adjust it. But uh, this is a low temperature, just during this uh, range. And if you use the liquid to, to miss the porcelain powder become the, the porcelain paste, and you don't worry if we uh, internal stain on the, our restoration, sur uh, uh, restoration surface and then we can apply maybe the let's see uh, porcelain layer and I also can do back to 760. It's don't worry because your color and everything is fixed and keep on inside. Don't worry about that. But uh, don't do back the biomic over the 800 is uh, too high. Sometimes we will, you will get a bubble. And I want to uh, let you know about the vacuum or without the vacuum. Because the biomic is very high density, the material. So even you without vacuum, you don't worry the color is changing. This is the with the vacuum and the after back, we can do see the uh, uh, high situation, high chroma and the still have the translucent. And this is the applied biomic on surface, but I bag it without the vacuum. You can do see the color and the situation is a different change, but the translucent is a little different. You can do see without the vacuum, your, your past F bag is more strong color and a little more high value. Why? Because you without the vacuum, you, you, you can do get the very uh, strong uh, translucent. Why is the uh, make the this uh, the result? Because the I said the biomic pest is very uh, nice material and the good property and the high density. But when we to miss or to uh, adjust with the liquid, sometimes you will make it the not the very uh, high density. So if you to back with without the without the vacuum, sometimes you will lose a little translucent. But the color and the and the chroma and the situation is never changed. But when you back it with the uh, vacuum, you can get more and the better translucent. So you can use this skill and the concept to control you want the result and the effect. So this is the interesting skill. Sometimes I wanted to uh, create a very strong the colorizing very like the white spout, white band is very strong and the high chance of uh, high opacity. I will eat, uh, back it the last time without the vacuum and I can get it I want. So this is interesting.
And uh, I also can to use the very fast uh, the program and the very fast skill to one back to finish my restoration program. Maybe it's a simple color to match the Vita pen. We can to uh, see this the skill and the procedure. I just uh, to apply the, the, the uh, glass paste on the surface first, and it's very, very thin. And I can to apply the main color shade on the cervical and the transfer effect on age. And uh, I just put the furnace to one back. I can to get the nice effect. It's a one back, just only one back. So I said, if you want the faster to get the Vita pen, or not a real tooth color. It's a simple and easy. You can use the one bag, and this is a fast skill. And then you also can to use a one bag to create a more compass the color, but sometimes it's not easy to control the detail and the small and the fine color. But are you a very nice technician and you also have a good skill and you can control it very well. Don't worry, you also can do one bag and the procedure is the same. First is apply the glass for, for a loosened past on the surface, very, very thin. And then now you can do apply any one of the detail color, maybe the shade A on cervical and the hollow effect on age and the, and the blue uh, translucent effect on the, on the, and on the uh, enamel area. And also to mameron color, or the terracotta or, or a quick light, you can do the one back to apply any color in it. But it must remember if you apply more and the more color on the surface, it's not easy to control and that will make the your restoration past is more more sick. So sometimes you're not easy to control the sickness, but it's a, don't worry. I say that if, if, if not, you don't need 100% to match and they're not very precise. You can also do one back finish your case is no problem. Don't worry. So you can do see this is the final result. It's a lot of color yeast, and that is the personality, the 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 the, the personality, the the neutral look. But I said it's uh, needed to uh, very very uh, precise skill and control it every material very. Uh, well, so this is a little difficult, but if you just uh, to practice, you can to get uh, this. So I think it's not difficult. But I, I my daily work, I more like this. If sometimes I want to create every color is more precise, I will to use this skill. I will spend two time or three times sometimes. And the first time I just uh, wash the liquid one on the surface, and I, I will apply the main color and the warm color and the hollow effect in the back first. And the second time I just to apply the translucent color, sorry. And the second time I will to apply the translucent color or some color like that to back. And I can to uh, get the very clear and the significant different color in I want the area. And everything is very detailed. And the third time I will to apply the 3D layer so I can get the surface and the final result is like a laying ground. So this is my skill. So in my daily work, I'm more like the, this. You can to see everything is more clear and uh, precise. It's a, a good the neutral look. So you can to see it's uh, easy. So biomic is a very easy the, the material to uh, help you to finish the daily work. Because then nowadays the modern is more and more popular. It's not only the cornea, even this in DC can more is more and more popular. Why? Because every patient over dentist, they don't like about the chipping and then they don't want to uh, the, the crown is a very safe and uh, keep and maintain the patient's mouth a long time. Patient also, the, the, uh, they, they also have the same want. Why? Because the tooth is not cheaper and uh, go to the clinic and uh, to uh, miss with the data and the treatment brings a very long time procedure. So if possible, I finish the treatment, they don't want to use their tooth a very long time. Not, a, not the always to come back to complain about the chipping. So now more discovery restoration is more, more popular. But in the past, uh, the stem powder or system is not easy to 
get a very nice the result. So now we create a pulsating test. Is it a biomink and the easy to control and the make that you want? And uh, I show you the, this the very interesting skill I can do use the biomink to create the young teeth. This is a monolithic, it's a 3D probation color. And I use the uh, biomega to 2D stand, only 2D. Sorry. And I apply the 3D paste on the surface. And I will dry it. And I create micro texture on the surface. You see, it's interesting, it's a micro texture. It's a horizontal and the vertical. I create it on the surface and after the bag and i mechanical polish you can do see the very strong and a nice color and a nice effect you can to see it's a without the the, the porcelain layer is the monolithic and that is a very easy and a fast finish and this is the middle edge this is a very similar this is the 3 uh, 3d pro a2 color and i also to stain it with the biomic and after bake, I apply the 3D pass. This is a 3D urn. And after the bake, you can do the surface is not like the layer, uh, like the porcelain crown look. It's, they are very similar. So you can do see this is a 3D effect. This is a without a 3D. But the color is no problem. But when we apply the 3D pass on the surface, we can get a very nice effect. And after my skill for the uh, uh, mechanical polish, later will become more smooth and the more neutral look and the more, more soft. It's not very strong. So you can do see this is a middle edge crown. And then you also can do see I created some micro texture on the surface. And this is the old age here. And remember, this is a 3D Pro A3.5. And uh, I stain a lot of color on the surface. This is only the Biomega 2D stain. You can do see it's uh, colorful and, uh, and uh, more, uh, it's a little difficult. And uh, every color is very significant. And I also do apply the 3D on the surface. This is a 3D layer, 3DN and uh, to dry it and i create uh, some polarity and uh, some micro on the surface and after the bag you can do a different look and i also use my, uh, my mechanical polish you can do see the surface is a nice like the porcelain crown so this is the material you just use the very easy and the best skill in the program get the very like the new look like a laying crown so if i can do create this effect i i don't need the heavy case need to layer it then my customer my dentist is a so for the patient it's very nice and you can do see the stuff this is a 3D layer. We can to create a micro texture and make it a very uh, nice the effect and a nice light refreshing on the surface. You can to see it's a very light the porcelain crown. You see, it's a nice. And uh, this is a real case in the patient's mouth. And uh, this is a primola. And I also like to use the, this is a 3D Pro and I use the uh, Biomix stain. And the, this is a fringe on the patient's mouth. It's the, like the neutral tooth and the, like a laying ground, but it's a never chipping. So it's a very interesting and a nice material. So if we wanted to create a Primola posterior case, I think I use a Biomix will save a lot of time. And uh, this is the two primola is the same. I also chose the 3D Pro, this is the A2, A2 I, maybe, I remember it's the A2, and I use the biomic stain, and I can to create the main color, translucent area, and the chloridic color. You can to see it's very similar to the lower teeth. 
but it's also no chipping and uh, good for the patient and the dentist. I think it's the three win. Everyone is happy. And uh, for anterior, we also can to use uh, this skill. Even this is a uh, 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 metal obama, it's a dark obama coloration. And I will use the, the, the opaque liner inside to cover uh, this uh, dark shade. And uh, I also like to choose the 3D pull up, but I apply the uh, opaque liner in inner core to cover uh, this uh, dark shadow. So you can do see to uh, show the black dark shadow. And outside, I also use the uh, Biomic 2D. And uh, uh, yes, this is, a, this is a Biomic 2D and the 3D on the surface. It can very easy to finish the multi unit uh, restoration. You don't spend a lot of time and it's also no tripping. Sometimes the patient have the crowding tools or heavy buy. I think this is more the safe design. And for this case, it's the same. I also chose the 3D Pro Reconia. And this area is a, a, a little defect. So I apply a little porcelain layer, it's a 3D layer in this area. And the first bag is apply a little to adjust the contour and the second bag to, uh, uh, to uh, apply the color and the stain it. And I can do get it a nice effect and a very similar and neutral look. And then you can do see, I very like the, to uh, create a micro texture on the surface. Let we all, uh, I will like to create the micro texture on the 3D layer surface because after the bag at least more like a neutral look and the more like you see this is a neutral canine. I like to create at least the, the corridatic on the surface. They will make the layer very similar. You see, it's a make the your uh, more discrete restoration is more like the neutral teeth and the more close to the positive crown. So this is an interesting and uh, very uh, easy learning skill. If possible, you can do try. Just apply the 3D layer on surface and uh, use the hot air, dry it, and uh, create the, some micro texture before baking. So after baking, you can get the interesting uh, effect and, uh, uh, and you want. And the, during the mechanical polish, you can make everything more softer and smooth and more neutral. And also we can do use it on the distinct uh, DCK restoration. Like this is a distinct DCK veneer case. And this is uh, my stuff to create and I help him to adjust. I, I must say she make a good job. You can do see this uh, uh, distinct DCK veneer. I chose the, the uh, DC press. It's the uh, HD. You can do see during the moral DC, I, during the biomix stain, we can get it's a very nice effect. And it's a very neutral look. So I say surface we can create. So I very like the 3D layer. It's easy to control and easy to create we want. And it's not difficult. Of course, the, you see the stain to the uh, onlay or inlay or overlay is also nice. And the fine is no problem. So I said the biomic is a easy, is an open system and it's a universal. For your your laboratory, you can use it to finish the, I think the almost the 90% case and save a lot, maybe the 50% time, and you can to uh, work off and go home very fast. And in the past, in my opinion, I'm also a ceramics in the past. I also like to lay, but in nowadays, laying is not the my daily work. Maybe sometimes it's dentist want I will lay in case for them, but it's not my daily work. And in the past, we will use the pre center uh, pre staining color on the more restoration. But I I ever said I don't like to use the color liquid because color liquid will change the diconia uh, chains and the stability and the muscular property. So the color liquid is not good for the draconia. Even it's a little, maybe it's not a very significant the effect, but I don't like to use that. And the, it's the also to, uh, is a little danger before the syndrome. 
when you to uh, stand or create something on the green stage, sometimes we will have the problem after the sintering. You will find the quick light or the color is a, uh, is a different or after the sintering, we will feel that some area is green. So I don't like to uh, use the pre-sintering, uh, pre-staining uh, pre skill on the cornea. So I like to choose the multi-layer is like the 3D and then to use the biomic on the surface. And then now my daily work is almost is use the visual tech. It's a design is the, like the, uh, 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 I, I have to say, adjust the cutback on the surface and my age and the power size is all full raconia. It's all framework. So I can create a more customized uh, uh, customize and the personality aesthetic for a single crown and then never to worry about the chipping situation. So sometimes if I want to lay, I will choose this skill. And uh, if the multi-layer case or a more simple case, I will use the external stand. I will use the multi-layering or the thin layering. And uh, just use the uh, biomic the 2D effect. And I will apply the 3D effect on the surface to create a, like the uh, laying crown look. So it's a very easy. So in my daily work, maybe the over 15% case is like the least skill. So it's a very easy. Sometimes the, my son customer, they also can to see uh, laying crown or slaying crown, is, which is different. They will, he will ask me, he can to uh, explain which one is the daily, which one is the stain. So I say it's interesting. So my dentist, uh, my, cus my, my customer sometimes will, joke, will say the joke, my stain skill is better than the layering. So I, I say, oh, yes, I, I don't know. I, I needed to lens or to cry because it's an interesting skill. And uh, this is uh, use the 3D layer to uh, on the sing more single crown case. I must say, if I want to use the biomic to external stand to match the single crown or the more uh, just only one crown to match the neutral teeth, sometimes this is uh, more difficult. We need to uh, spend a lot of time to create every small detail. So it's more, it's more, it's really like the layering, just layering a lot of positive, different type of positive, or stand a lot of different stand. So, but if you stand, sometimes it's, uh, it's not easy to control like the porcelain because porcelain uh, powder is more bigger particle size and more rough when you to apply on the surface. You can to make it very stable on there, but the staining with, with the stain with the liquid, sometimes that will move and throwable and the very small detail and the very fine detail is not easy to control. So if I want to create, to match the neutral teeth, I will spray the many times the backing. So sometimes uh, in my daily work, I wanted to create the single crown. I will use a fish, facial layer te technique. But it's a, for more simple the single crown case, I will use just only stone stand like this one. This is a 3D Pro and the external stand and the 3D layer in. After the back, and then we can to see is it like the, the, the laying crown and the layer similar. This is a simple color for me. So I can to use a external stand, create the, like the porcelain dude, like the neutral teeth. So I said the biomic have the, uh, no limit, the, the, the effect and the no limit possible. You can to try you want. And then for this case is the full crown. And then you can to see a lower teeth is, a, is like an old age and it's very uh, competitive color. And I also can to use the biomic to create lead, but I need to spend the, maybe the three time or four time to stain it. You see, this is a 3D Pro and I adjust the surface and the polish make it more look at the translucent. And uh, this is a 2D, 3D biomic 2D to stain on the surface, you can to see it's a very different effect on the surface. And apply the 3D and uh, create the micro texture on the surface and after the back and the mechanical polish. And then you can choose the, this is interesting. Maybe it's not perfect, but for the, 
the uh, our value of social distance, we can do see this is more this even is a very close up to uh, take a picture. I must say it's also a nice effect, but it's not a hundred percent like the person there in front. But for the multi unit case, I think it's enough and nice for the patient because the patient also told me he don't want his uh, uh, tooth wheel to crack because he said this is the implant case and that this is the three crowns expensive for him. So sometimes this is the patient's choice or the dentist's choice or the technician help a to choice. So I must say this is interesting for our uh, daily work. So we, must, we can do think which one is more good design or which one is more better than the, your customer. So we can do think a choice that nice material help us and help them. And another interesting material is biomedical gun. And uh, I must say it's not usually and uh, uh, to need to create a gun restoration in your daily work. If you are have a, a lot of imprint case or you are uh, uh, focused on to make it all on for like this the big case, I think I believe you have a lot of the gun, uh, gun situation can to layer or to apply. But for us, maybe not every day I can to meet this case. So I create, I wanted to make the guns more easy. Why? Because the gun is not like the teeth. Guns more simple color. It's not very difficult and uh, don't have a lot of detail. We just the choice the main color and to match the gun. And uh, you can very easy and create you want effects. So I to analyze a lot of the real teeth and the two choice and the content about the color and the, I to uh, analyze and the, and the after study, I, I get the uh, a result and I will show you my experience. That is my concept to design the design of the gun color. And I also test her and uh, to bag and to miss a lot of different brand color to find the uh, more close to the neutral, neutral gun color. And I will back it and uh, create a customized uh, the interesting uh, procedure for me. During uh, this procedure, I also learned a lot. And I create the five color is the pink one to pink five. So this is uh, interesting. And I also to uh, edit the, the to the 3D layer and the one the pink R in this uh, gun set. For this uh, eight uh, bottle, you can to miss the any one, uh, you can miss the uh, every case and the create everything is easy. And then for the pink one to pick for the 3D layer, gun is uh, very different. Why? Because the uh, uh, in the gun area, sometimes we need to keep a very strong strength of the draconia uh, framework so we can do cut back too much. So we, I apply the, the gun main color is the 3D layer, always a 3D layer. So pink one to pink four is all 3D layer. But the pink five is a modified color for a broad reversal. So it's the 2D. And then we also have the pink R and the 3D and 3D V. So we can very during the, this five color easy to apply the, uh, the imprint restoration framework. Uh, we can do apply the imprint uh, framework and the easy to create a gun, neutral gun look. You can do see this, the six color, pink one, pink two, pink three, pink four, 3 dn 3 dv is a 3D path. And the 2D path is the pink five and the pink R. And it also can use the liquid one and the liquid two to mix and the apply control the concept. And you can easily to control the, this the paste like the layering or like the staining. And then this is my concept to analyze about the gun area and the gun part. First area we can to see the mucosa area and the middle side is the uh, main color. And the close the teeth that this the connector area is a free change bar area. This is the the gun uh, structure. I, I, I can do say this is like the gun structure. 
And the surface we have the more strong and uh, all significantly uh, characteristic. It's like a, a intensive area is more dark, is a more darker red, or we can do see like the bone area is more high contour or bright or more white. So this is a very interesting. So we just uh, to keep and control these uh, five uh, factors, and uh, we can to make it our gun, uh, our artificial gun is like the neutral, and uh, we don't uh, through the layering. We just use the staining skill, and uh, we also can to create a surface uh, a detail like the steeple. So it's a very easy and uh, and uh, and the faster to get you want the the gong effect. And uh, this, I also say this uh, like the biomic. This is a free and open system. So we can do the right to use the gong system on the white draconia framework or multi layer color draconia framework or even use it to uh, modify the pink porcelain layer. We can do adjust or increase the surface, the intensive or surface polarized color. And we also can do modify artificial gun and to create a surface feature, the steeple. Even if the, the porcelain layer, we can do use the depth. And this is a standard uh, uh, gun layer procedure. So it's not difficult. I just uh, to uh, apply the pink to the main area in, in the gun main uh, part. And uh, I will apply the mucosa in in the in the best area and uh, apply the uh, free gingiva color. Use the pink one on the the more top area, and I will use the pink one to miss the three D V or the red. Use the pink one to apply on the bone area, and uh, I also use the pink for intensive color on a uh, bone concave area. To create this, so we can to see, we can to uh, look, uh, we can look at the, this framework, and we can to see very strong the contrast about the gun effect before the uh, backing. And I also can to dry it and to create uh, some detail on the surface. And at uh, first time backing, and the second time I will apply the three D N or the three D B on the surface uh, uh, to create a stable effect. So it's a very easy and a simple skill. Sorry. Yeah, and after the back, you can do get a very nice effect. It's the, like the laying, uh, like a laying result. And this is the faster the, 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 the stain skill is like the staining. I just use the pink R and the pink five to uh, stain on the framework surface base, a uh, base uh, surface. And the uh, first, uh, back the first time, and the second time, I just the red pre, uh, apply the pink two or a 3DN on the surface and uh, make it a steeple and the back two times back, I can do very fast get I want effect. So it's uh, easy and fast. I don't need to uh, spend a lot of time to create the uh, uh, gun gun effects and I don't need to layer it. It's like the stain is very, very fast. Maybe just five minutes you can finish the whole work. Even if it's a full mouse, just maybe 10 minutes and you can create the, uh, have a contrastor and uh, a different light effect and uh, it's a neutral look. So it's a faster gun skill. And if possible, I say you can uh, use the other system to miss the, this, the gun pass is also like the biomic, the stain, the original, no, uh, original kit. And I said, if sometimes uh, in past I will use the, uh, I want to modify my framework. Even I told you, you maybe you don't need to modify your framework, but if you want to modify your framework, like the white zirconia, I can too use the pink file or pink art. But if you want to make it a more uh, rough or different uh, light reflection, because of the sun, the cornea is not a very translucent. So you want to get the more beauty or more uh, soft light reflection, maybe you can use the uh, different 
uh, different brand there, the uh, gum modified powder, even like the GTFM5, this is a low temperature or creation FG, FSG is a uh, 800 temperature, this is a low temperature. You can apply on the, your gum area and the first bag and uh, just uh, to apply the uh, uh, biomic gum. And I don't do recommendation use the high temperature the gum modifier. Because the, this is the too high temperature, maybe like the 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 Ivoclar, the Dyna, Gingiva, it's a too high temperature. You need to lots a lot of time to for baking and the cooling. And uh, you will lose the you a lot of time. So I more like to use the low temperature and the to miss the uh, to fix the with the bulbing is no problem. But if you use the high temperature uh gun carbon modifier, it's also okay. But uh, you just need a lot of time to bake it. But if you want to uh, finish your powder, it is also okay. You can do, do this. But just to keep careful because the to back to temperature for your framework, especially with the gun par framework. If you have framework with the gun par, let it mean this framework is very bigger. So the back temperature is very, very sensitivity. So please keep careful. And the control your back program is very, very careful. And uh, I say, uh, if you just very fast to create a neutral gun look, you just use the pink too, and the uh, and, uh, and, uh, pure color. But if you want to uh, duplicate or simulation a neutral gun look, pink too is not enough. But we can to use a pink too to miss the pink R or pink five. You can do this very easy. You can do create a different situation, different bright and a different rate level main color so it's a very easy to miss and i ever told you biomic material is to miss is easy and uh, very very smooth well and another rough surface and then without bubble so you don't worry to miss it to create a new color and uh, we also can to uh, in the mucosa area some patient is more purple and more dark and uh, you can use the pink street to mix the blue one to create a different level purple color and we also can use the pink one to uh miss the cdn make your free change bar more translucent or to uh miss the cdv make your uh free change bar is more bright so this is interesting and it's easy so i say this is not a difficult uh, skill and uh, it's also very easy concept for to use uh, this the uh, liquefied ceramic paste so i can very easily create the different level, different dark, different situation, the different uh, brightness the uh, gun area. Just use the, the, the this uh, gun, uh, gun system. And uh, this is uh, my uh, my video for uh, how to use the biomic the gun area. I think maybe the, some uh, some friends or some the participants ever to see this on the Facebook or or other or editor website but i will show you again it's very fast i think it's the almost uh, the six uh, minutes so please uh, to see it Thank you. 
又会比到。I'm I'm very sorry because I can't to make sure uh, about the video or everything is uh, run very smooth and uh, no more in in the internet because the some agent stop told me they can to see the video and uh, sometimes not very smooth to run it so I can to make sure everyone can see it very well but maybe. Uh, I will finish at least the video is almost finished and uh, I will try to explain about the, my slide. If everyone has any questions later, you can to ask, uh, with, uh, ask to the, the edit staff and send a message to them. They will let me know and I will, ask, uh, I will answer your question. And I'm very sorry because sometimes the two of the webinar the internet is not too easy to control. Even in my side, everything uh, is looking uh, nothing and uh, normal. But uh, in your side, maybe it's not very well or smooth. So I can do control uh, this situation. I'm really sorry. So if you have a question, you can do send message to the editor. The, the, the co worker and the staff, and the lay, that they will let me know, and I will answer your question. They told me maybe uh, some participants just uh, can to listen uh, the voice and uh, can to see the, the, the display and the screen. So I, I'm really sorry. This is the first bag. After bag, so you can to see the very nice uh, effect about uh, the biomic down system. You see, this is a close up. It's a very neutral and uh, like a uh, laying effect.
And if you use the, this uh, system and uh, this skill, you can very fast finish the, your big case and the long span from work. And then you can get the neutral look at this and the neutral look gun area. So Biomega is a very easy and a fast uh, uh, material and uh, system for your daily work. If, we, uh, if possible, I want you to try this because it's more easy and uh, fast. And then finally, I wanted to explain about the Biomega why it's a different other spray the stem pest because it's more easy handle and use it. And uh, it also have a good the wet capability for use why? If you, you open the bottle and you see it's a, a little uh, dry and uh, not wet, but don't worry, just to miss it again, you can do see it's uh, become like the normal and uh, it's also the, the weight ability is uh, good for use. And uh, we also have a, give you a very easy concept to, uh, to start use this uh, material. Why? Because you don't do think too much. You just choose the area and to choose the color to match it. You can very fast to find you want the color and finish your case. And that is also high for a and effect. Because in the uh, in the mouse, we know the draconia or or the distances can know for reasons. And the sun that put in the mouse after some test is easy become more darker. But our uh, outside external stem pads have a fluorescein effect, and uh, later we'll make the URTs uh, and the urethration in the dark area or a dark situation. It don't look very very uh, uh, dark or bright. And uh, we also have the two different liquid for use. You can do choices you want and to miss it and uh, to easy to control. And the color effect is the, is the direct view. So I say to mix the color paste, uh, to mix the pulsating uh, stem paste is a direct view. Which color is you miss and you can do direct see the color. But the pulsating powder when you do miss, you need to add the back just again to see the, the color and the effect. But the paste, color paste, is very easy and uh, you can direct to see the, the effect like the after back so we can easy to control and the direct view and uh, we also have a very good and uh, and the strong uh, the chroma situation and also still have the translucence and uh, you can do use your one backing still to get what you want and save a lot of time and uh, i said it's the more homogeneous and the smooth and the stable vitamin after the baking. And uh, we have the 2D color pads uh, and the LED is also the uh, uh, ceramic pads. And uh, we also have the 3D is more bigger and the more thick the ceramic pads. So it's a uh, very easy to control and uh, you can do choice of these two create you want. And I also say this is the open system for the old dental lab. You can to use it only the right use the biomic and that you also can to use the other brand to mix with biomic so you don't worry that is a very friendly with the other brand so don't worry you choose the biomic and uh, you you will to uh uh, uh lost your other other material you don't you 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 can to sell that you can to still to use it to with the biomic and uh, to finish that so it's a very easy and friendly and uh, I'm uh, sorry about the today. Maybe the internet is not very smooth, and uh, maybe you can to see very well or a good presentation. I must uh, say so sorry. This is my responsibility. Maybe next time I will try to with the uh, I did try to uh, find the maybe good uh, solution to promote about the wedding night because I needed this the situation two times. Yeah, because today I don't know why because the yeah. In the net, the problem I can do control. So maybe that's time we can to uh, try to maybe uh, pre-record, and I, I can to uh, set the back to wait to finish my presentation, and I will to answer your question. So this maybe is all easy, but I will try and to find the problem to support it. And today is very thanks about your joy. I uh, thanks your join, and I'm gonna say sorry about my problem uh, for you. Thanks for your join.
Okay. Now I will try to uh, answer the question. 哎，你们听得到吗？真的？听得到，听得到。两个问题嘛。嗯。Okay. Now I have the two question. One question is how to tone down the intensity of the color for the experimental blue one or blue two. Uh, when I apply the ceramic and I feel it is the too blue. And I wanted to turn down the blue color. I said, if you wanted to uh, uh, decrease about the color situation, maybe like the blue one or blue two, you can do miss the glass paste and then you can control is the same consistency. And it's like the same, uh, 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 it's more easy and then not to become the purple just to miss the, the glass glass paste and after the bake maybe the uh, one one two one or two two one you can do try and bake the first and then you can do find the which the situation the blue is you want so this is a very easy every color you can do miss the the, the glass paste and then to decrease the situation it's a very easy and if you want to make it thin and not very strong the blue you also can to use the diluting uh, liquid but sometimes the diluting liquid will make it not easy control if you want to uh, stand very fine detail area sometimes they will move so it's the two uh, two different way for the uh, for uh, to miss a lot of the liquid one you can to make it thin and uh, also get that you want the effect but they, when you to mix the glass paste, it's also going to decrease the situation, but uh, your thickness is the same. So this is uh, interesting. So you can to try and uh, to choose which you want. And the uh, second question is, do you stand a gun before tea staining or both the same time? Uh, in my experience, uh, I will tell you, because the gum stain procedure is more simple, and uh, just only the maybe the two back I can to finish the old program. So sometimes I will uh, to spend my teeth the first one time, and uh, to control and uh, set my my cervical line area in where because I must know to separate the final my gun area and my tooth area which the layer line and the junction. So first time I will to back the my tooth the main color first time. And the second time I will to apply the gun area and the steel to stand the to the detail characteristic. And the third time I will apply the 3D on my tooth and apply the 3D on the gun area to create a steeple. So my daddy boy, I usually just only the three time can finish the old work. But for just only tooth, maybe I can use the two bag or the three bag to finish. But almost for the posterior crown, I just use the one bag because uh, it's a very simple and we don't to uh, make it 100% to match the neutral tooth. Sometimes the, for posterior, the patient, they don't care and the dentist also care a lot. So we can very use the, uh, we can do use a very fast skill to finish the, our work. So, okay. okay. Have you another question? And uh, I, I see the match. Please. Okay. I think I don't have a question. I okay. believe the AV participant can do use it very well. After the presentation, if you are internet very smooth. I believe everyone is a feel is very easy and uh, and uh, and uh, nice control for you. So it's very thank you and thanks everyone joined the, this the webinar and uh, hope you have a good day. And now Taiwan is almost the eleven o'clock p.m. So now I will turn back to the edit stop late.
And uh, if you have the question in future, you also can to try to contact me. You can do send message to me. Maybe you can find me on the Facebook or the Instagram, or you can do send message to the editor, send to the Lay or Roya. They will transfer your question for me, and I will also answer you. Okay, thank you, everyone. Okay, thanks for Mr. Kang. Today we have finished. Thanks again, Zoya and uh, Mr. Santiago. Uh, next month we have implant implant course. If you are interested, uh, you can follow our Facebook edit A I D I T. Thank you. See you. Bye. Hello. Hello. <laughs> 听不到你讲话, <笑> 这能听到声音, 视频的声音能听到吗? 听不到 能看见屏幕是吧? 但是听不见是吧? 嗯 关掉了啊。